come in a lot of shapes and sizes, mainly bulky and bulkier. Now, some companies are trying to change that. Surprisingly, first out of the gate with the foldable drone wasn't a drone maker, it was GoPro. Now DJI, the biggest drone maker in the world, has their own foldable drone, the Mavic Pro. Like GoPro, the Mavic is much simpler to operate than many other drones, and that's kind of the point. This isn't just geared to the professional filmmaker. They're also thinking about someone who might want to quickly toss their drone in a bag to get that perfect shot. Safety has become paramount for governments and drone makers. The Mavic has a lot of the features that we've seen on the most recent DJI drones, like obstacle avoidance, but now they're also focusing on gesture control. So you can set down the controller, wave your arms and the drone will find you, or even go like this to take a selfie, or a drone. DJI and GoPro clearly think foldable drones is the next big thing. If you compare the two, they cost about the same, DJI's weighs a lot less, and ironically, GoPro's doesn't come with a camera. That's sold separately. More and more, these two companies are flying into each other's territories, but GoPro is the one playing catch-up. While their stock has been hammered since their IPO, DJI hasn't just become number one, they've found success outside of drones, including with their standalone cameras.